they were disappointed in you know what happened and um, but uh, you know that's one of those things where um, we'll deal with him and deal with it internally and move on. New Mexico State Offensive Coordinator Tim Beck drew the short straw. It was Beck, not the university president, a board of regent member or athletic department staffer, even a statement from the university. Beck was trotted out to discuss the alleged actions of his quarterback Diego Pavia in a now viral video appearing to urinate on the University of New Mexico's practice field. Beck gave the university's first real public comments about the video that hasn't been a great look for NMSU or Pavia since our NBC affiliate in Albuquerque KOB published the video on Sunday night. As you heard there, Beck's uh, Beck has called Pavia's actions disappointing, adding that the matter would be dealt with internally. Now, the video appears to show Pavia urinating on the Lobos logo at the University of New Mexico's indoor practice facility in Albuquerque. Beck confirmed what we reported yesterday that this alleged incident occurred well before the season started not two weeks ago when the Aggies played the Lobos at UNM. Beck said that to his knowledge, Pavia hadn't yet been punished by the school or team. The Aggies knew about the video's existence before Pavia played in last week's game at Hawaii. Now, Beck said that Pavia's conduct was unbecoming of what they expect from everyone in their program. You have high expectations for all your all your players. And so again, like we're we're, we're disappointed in his actions, um, disappointed in what happened, but again, it'll be handled internally and then we're going to move forward. Anything that's uh, negatively uh, an act, something happens uh, is a distraction from what we're trying to do. And we're trying to find ways to, to limit those as much as possible. So if something like this pops up, you've got to handle it and then move on. Beck said he didn't know who filmed the video or how Pavia may have gained access to the facility. UNM head coach Danny Gonzalez gave a no comment on the video when asked at his press conference this afternoon. As of today, Beck said he expects Pavia to play in New Mexico State's next game at Aggie Memorial Stadium. That's next Wednesday, October 4th versus Florida International. If you're wondering why Tim Beck handled the weekly press conference today instead of head coach Jerry Kill, Beck said that Kill was unable to be there and that he'll be fine, adding that it was a long trip back from Hawaii for the Aggies and that Kill was exhausted and he would be back as soon as he felt ready. It's the second time in three weeks the kill has missed a scheduled press conference. He missed it as uh, well as multiple practices in the lead up to the Aggies win over uh, UNM September 16th with a medical issue. NMSU practices tomorrow morning. We'll see if kill is on hand then.